Well, I think travel is so cheap to uh, Europe this fall for several reasons. You had Brexit a while back, which definitely makes the dollar stronger, especially in that particular currency. You also have terrorism that has occurred over the last eight to 12 months or so in a variety of ways. That's certainly gonna depress de demand a little bit. It's a slower time of year in the fall. Generally, this just means that there's some empty seats. And when there's some empty seats, we see cheaper prices. And I'm not talking about cheaper prices. I'm talking about ridiculously low prices. These are also being driven by some low cost carriers that are flying over the transatlantic. You have Wow, uh, Norwegian, Aer Lingus, for example. You also have uh, a couple of crazy routes from uh, Air New Zealand and Emirates also flying over uh, into Europe as well. Good competition, lower prices, dollar strong. It's uh, all green when it comes to going to Europe. I wouldn't expect prices to jump dramatically, except for what you would expect normally for seasons. As you get into spring and summer, you definitely would see an increase there. And as kids go back to school next year, you'll see those prices drop. As long as fuel prices stay low, I think this will be the best couple of years to fly into Europe in the last 10. The places you need to go are places like the Nordic countries. You have Denmark, Sweden, Norway, Finland are cheap. You also have uh, Ireland, which is inexpensive. Spain has been cheaper. Also Portugal right next door has been cheaper recently. We also have Germany uh, inexpensive as well. So stay off the beaten path. You'll see it a little bit cheaper, but still the most important cities that everybody wants to visit once in their life, London, Paris, and Rome, those are inexpensive as well. For those of you that think that it's too cold to go to Europe in the fall, think again. I think the fall is the best time to actually fly to Europe. All the Europeans are back from vacation. They were all in vacation in August. They get back, you get the natural uh, flavors of all the different cities. It's really fun to do as well. The weather is great. It's not like it's freezing cold. It can get dipped down in some places in the northern parts in the, the high 40s, low 50s, but you'll see in some of the other southern uh, countries, it'll be in the low 60s, the mid 70s, a perfect time. A little jacket sometimes in the evening, perfect time to go to Europe. Thank you.